Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Rad here from Radko Tarot and this is going to be Capricorn Sun, Capricorn Moon and Capricorn Rising weekly tarot reading for July 9th to July 15, 2018. And before we go there guys, I want to tell you that now in addition to the general monthly tarot readings that can be found on my YouTube channel, you can as well uh, participate into supporting the channel furthermore and purchasing the uh, extended monthly tarot reading for just as little as one dollar and in it in that particular video the extended video um, we are going to we are actually focusing on specifically on the career and the relationship life for the star sign so uh, <clears throat> You can find those readings at my website written down below in the description of this video under the section of extended monthly tar readings. So that being said, let's go and see what happens with um, Capricorns here. The first card that marks their topic is the Six of Swords. Then we do have the Temperance as a core of the situation. Uh, then uh, is the Five of Swords as the, um, uh, um, the challenges. And afterwards, we do have the Two of Cups as um, as a guidance. So what we do have during this particular week, Capricorns, is that you will come to terms with somebody that you have recently had a, a fight uh, fight with. All right. This is all that what these cards are saying. We do have the Six of Swords as a general topic here, sitting next to the core of the situation, which points to a huge compromise that you are going to make, and not just only you, but also the person. This is coming up to a, uh, this is coming up to terms, finding a common ground, and actually uh, reaching a, an understanding and an agreement, which both of you, uh, you and your partner in relationship, you and your wife or your husband or you or your boss or your supervisor are benefiting greatly, all right? So don't be stubborn Capricorns, it is what I can say here, because stubbornness sits as a challenge. It is what exactly could actually ruin the benefits you could take, because the Six of Swords here promises you that you're going to initiate a transition into these communications, into these relationships, which are going to improve the circumstances around the relationship, around the business and around the, the connection in general for a, a greater good. Not to mention that there will be a, a severe goal placed in front of you and that other party which you have been arguing until now, all right? Uh, a, a great to go, as I said, which are going to promise you as well great things. Very important to be said here with the temperance is to understand Capricorns that everybody has their own points of view and no matter are you like it or not, nobody asks you to follow their points of view, but you need to honor it and it all comes to that. You just need to show that you honor their points of view and every, every understanding is actually going to be settled out. This card shows here that you and that person of conflict is going to show compassion to one another, you are going to show uh, solidarity to one another and in general the, um, <clears throat> the temperance card is about that you will be able to settle the differences out and your relationship will start healing from now on. It is just here with the five of swords as a challenge points that you also could um, maintain your stubbornness and to want to dominate at all costs and eventually you will dominate, all right? But the cost is going to be more than you know. So it's it's kind of, these cards are pointing that it isn't worth it. So that's why here we do have the Two of Cups as a guidance card, all right? And the Two of Cups shows that you need to aim to share things with that guy or with that woman for that matter. Because the Two of Cups is about the, the shared experience and the shared, um, not exactly emotions, but a uh, um, shared experience. I'm not talking about an experience shared with that guy as an enterprise or with that woman for that matter as an enterprise. I'm talking about the experience you had outside of this connection and you just share with them so they can see uh, what actually is going on in your life. Because this card says that the shared happiness doubles happiness and the shared pain is half the pain. That being said, uh, you can actually win a very trusted friend here you can win a, a very uh, resourceful business partner you could save your marriage during that week for example or you could save your relationship as well the choice is yours what you're going to do Capricorns are you going to be stubborn and you will want to be your way and eventually your way will lead you to loneliness or are you will 
will be willing to make a compromise and to listen to show your solidarity and your compassion and to actually obtain um, peace with these people that depends entirely on you what i can tell you that lastly is that you don't need you, you should not be afraid to open yourself guys it's just simply what we do have here with the six of swords and with the two of cups because when you open yourself into somebody and show them what you feel and then show them how you uh, how you take things all right this is when actually the connection in between souls starts to merge and starts to happen it all comes to that are you ready to accept the person that stands in front of you for what he is or she is because this is what the temperance is all about you need to accept them with their advantages and their disadvantages with their pluses and with their minuses with their pros and with their cons all right are you willing to do so or you prefer to be on your own that's entirely your choice so with that being said Capricorns this was your weekly tarot reading for July 9th to July 15, 2018. I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it guys and in case you're interested in a private reading with me everything you need to know about it will be listed down there in the description of this video. Rat signing out now. See you next time. Bye.